Our faith in institutions is at an all-time low. We don't trust the media, our governments or NGOs. And why would we, when bullies are running the show? When things go wrong, it's no longer clear where to turn. So we turn on each other and we judge rather than learn. We judge from a safe distance, from the safety of our screens. In an era where the individual reigns supreme, how do we band together? Where do we find common ground? How do we bring justice for victims if they can't make a sound? It's time to break their silence, to step forward into the light, to let go of harmful beliefs and focus on doing what's right. It's time to throw out old-fashioned assumptions. The small voice in the back of your mind that says maybe if she'd just done something differently, maybe then she would have been fine. It's time to look at our role in the system, our part to play in the show. This doesn't just come down to an individual who was too drunk or too frightened to say no. Everyone contributes to culture. And if it's ever going to change, we need to support survivors rather than looking for blame. So it's time to stand up. It's not an option to stand by, because let's be clear, this is about basic civil rights. Sexual assault never happens as an isolated event. It's not about short skirts or alcohol or defining consent. It doesn't discriminate on sexuality or gender or race. It's known by many forms, but it doesn't have a face. It's not about fighting off strange figures hiding in the dark. It's about calling out harmful behavior when someone makes a harmless remark. Because sexual assault is about power. Big structures and small moments that govern us all. But it's time to change the conversation and find safe ground for all.